The Rotary Club of Kavari in partnership with Southwestern Regional Development Forum have today, the 22nd of May 2024, launched tree planting in Greater Chigezi and Ankole districts in a move to conserve the environment. Speaking to a reporter at Mwisi Primary School in Mwisi Parish, Chitumba Subcounty, where they planted 370 trees, some of which are fruits, shade and for timber production, the Vice Chairperson of Southwestern Regional Development Forum, Mr. Misaj Katsusime, said that they have launched a tree planting drive with Rotary Clubs within Greater Chigezi and Ankole districts, and they have started with the Rotary Club of Kavale. Katsime added that with the help of GEP President Nisima Ivrin Chikafunda, the initial trees they planted and other trees, they will be able to plant trees in Greater Chigezi and Ankole districts. He said that most of the environmental challenges they are facing have come as a result of cutting trees. He challenged the public to first think of planting more trees before cutting down a tree if they are to preserve the environment for the next five to ten years. Has to come. We are here as a Southwestern Regional Development Forum, a forum uh, that is composed of uh, Greater Kigezi District and also Greater Ankore District. And uh, we have pioneered or we have launched a tree planting drive with the Rotary Clubs of this region, starting with the Rotary Club of Kavari. Yes. With the help of our of Honorable Evelyn Nisima, the initial trees that we have planted today and other trees, uh, we will be able to plant trees all over the region, those two regions, Bankore and Kigez, so that we can conserve the environment. We have so many environmental challenges most of these environmental challenges have come up because of of the cutting of trees. So I'm encouraging and uh, urging people that yes, you can cut trees because the trees have so many uses. Mm. But whenever you think of cutting a tree, think of planting four or five trees, mm. such that in the next five, ten years, we can conserve the environment and we shall live happier lives and uh, the environmental challenges that we are facing now will be normal. Mm. Yeah, thank you. Karuma Charis, the member of the Rotary Club of Kavali, who is also aspiring for the chairmanship, said that the planted trees are for the Rotary Club of Kavali and Southwestern Regional Development Forum. He challenged the public to plant more trees as possible for the betterment of the environment. Yeah, because we have been planting trees at this school. Mm. And these trees are from the partnership of Rotary Club of Kavali and the Southwestern Region Development Forum. Mm. When we were in the DCA in Munyonyo, we met our DGE, mm. District Governor elect. She told us that uh, her project this year is making our environment green. Mm. That is through planting trees. And uh, she told us that uh, it is now a hundred years mm. since the inception of Rotary activities in Africa. Yes. started in South Africa. Mm. Now, she actually asked everybody to plant the balance. How does the balance come? Mm. It comes, for example, if you are aged 50, Yes. Then you subtract it from 100. You remain with 50. So you plant the 50 trees. Mm. If you have a child who is 10 years old, you subtract that 10 from 100. And you remain with 90. So plant 90 trees for this child. Mm. And this will definitely conserve our environment. Okay. How do you think? Now, take an example. Rotary Club of Kavali has no trees, mm. has no seedlings. But because they patterned with the Southwestern Region uh, Development Forum, because they patterned with the 2000 network, that is how they managed to get trees. And these trees were given to Rotary Club of Kavali because Rotary Club of Kavali managed to get where to plant these trees. And they managed to get the labor to plant the trees. And therefore, through partnership, our environment shall remain green. Okay. So I request everybody, wherever you are, in whatever you are doing, make sure that you partner with 
others. Canon Hillary Biuruganda, who is the board member of Southwestern Regional Development Forum, said that conserving the environment is part of the Southwestern Regional Development Forum focus. Biuruganda added that the Southwestern Regional Development Forum is a brainchild of local governments, saying that LOC5 chairpersons, district cows, speakers, and planners within Greater Chigezi and Ankole districts are members of Southwestern Regional Development Forum. He added that they focus on agro industrialization, tourism, climate, mineral developments, water management, among others. Uh, thank you, the Rot uh, Rotary Club of Kavari, for accepting. Uh, this partnership to proceed because the heart and the um, focus of uh, Swadif, ma much as it has uh, many areas of, co of, fo of focus and interest, but uh, conserving the environment is part of Swadif focus. So I want to thank you once again for enabling us to uh, be partners with you in this uh, area. Swadif is a brainchild of local governments of Ankore and Kigese. And actually, all chairmen, ROC5, all cows, all district speakers, all uh, district pl planners are members of Swadif. So Swadif is ours as citizens of Southwestern uh, region and we need to support the efforts of the leadership of Swadif. And we are focusing on agro-industrialization, on mineral development, on tourism, on natural resources, environment, climate change, and land and the, uh, water management. We focus on strengthening and development of the private sector. Uh, we, do, we focus on uh, promoting integrated transport infrastructure and services, sustainable energy development, human capital development, innovation and technology. And that's why we are in partnership with the universities, all universities in the southwestern region. Uh, partners in this cause and uh, we want to work with you as citizens of this region to mobilize the community towards uh, uh, improved livelihood of our people and of our community through uh, improved uh, household incomes and other activities that can enhance the development the region. Memory Guma Aguma for PAL Television.